A Marine wife reunites with her husband after he returns from Iraq. And it's not only his homecoming they're celebrating. News 10's Louisa Moeller has the story. It was more than a year ago when Michelle said goodbye to Adam. You're excited for him because it's something new that they get to go experience. You're scared because you don't know if that's the last time you're going to see him, the last time you're going to talk to him. She was left coping with her husband's absence and a difficult diagnosis of cervical cancer. That was then. This okay. is now. Daddy's fixing it. As always, we travel and come home. Michelle, Adam, and their two kids say a blessing before lunch, enjoying their time together as a family. Adam is home. And Michelle is healthy. It was neat to be able to actually call him and say, hey, guess what? It's, it's all good. Everything's gone. She learned that her cancer was in remission a week before Adam got back. But that was not the end of the good news for Michelle and Adam. They did a blood test and confirmed that we were pregnant. Despite fears that Michelle's cancer would prevent her from ever having a baby again, Michelle and Adam found out they would soon welcome another member to their family. Going from where I had to come home on emergency leave to deal with the cancer that she had been diagnosed with and then the possibility that pregnancy probably or maybe not even going to happen anyway to, to this now where she is pregnant was just a, a blessing from the Lord himself. Michelle and Adam have no plan for the future. They are just embracing the present. We put our faith in the Lord and, and he'll provide for us. Mm -hmm. uh, wherever he, he wants us to be, we'll be. Reporting in Rockville, Louisa Moeller, News 10. And Adam says with Michelle's support, he plans to deploy overseas again.